Hello YouTubers, I'm Parwiz and in this video I'm going to show you that how you can plot uh, pie charts from your Python program to the Excel file. So uh, you can see that uh, uh, like this we are going to plot this pie chart from our Excel uh, from our Python to the Excel file. So now let's get started. Uh, the first thing uh, I need uh, you need you need to install uh, Excel uh, SX writer so you can write pip install x uh, XLS and uh, X writer <coughs> so we are going to use this for uh, plotting our pie chart you can uh, plot different charts uh, in this video we are going to uh, uh, use a pie chart so let me first import I have already installed this uh, first import Excel S, uh, SX writer uh, the name is so hard okay after this uh, we are going to create a workbook uh, you don't need any Excel file uh, the creation of Excel file so you can create uh, auto programmatically the Excel file so let me create a work book and from here Excel writer dot workbook and in here you need to give your uh, name so let me give chart for example chart uh, pi dot excel sx so okay now uh, after this after creation of the workbook uh, now uh, we need to add the worksheet so let me create a worksheet uh, and workbook uh, dot add worksheet so after this now we need to create a format for our workbook so let me create a bold format so bold a uh, workbook <coughs> dot add format and in here uh, let me give a uh, bold bold one <coughs> okay so after creation of the format now we need to create our data list so our uh, data list that we need to use uh, so let me create the headings and in here I need to create a list of cate category and uh, <coughs> also I need uh, the values now for the data uh, the data I want to give so okay so the first data list is uh, the name let me give apple and for example cherry uh, banana and the second list is for our the values so 50 for apple uh, 40 for cherry and 10 for the banana okay so after this now we need to <coughs> write uh, uh, our, we need to uh, create a row and uh, for this uh, we need to write and create row you can give uh, your workbook or uh, no your worksheet dot write row uh, you can see we have right column we have uh, we need right row and uh, let me give it a2 the data 0 index 0 this is the first one and the worksheet dot right uh, okay so this was for right row uh, this is not a2 sorry this is a1 and uh, let me remove this these are for the columns sorry okay a1 and heading headings also add your format so this is the bold <coughs> okay after this now we are going to write the column of data so for this uh, we can say worksheet dot write column and uh, for this column a2 uh, and the data 0 
and for another one dot right column this is b2 and data 1 <coughs> okay so we have uh, uh, write our column uh, now we need to uh, create our uh, uh, type of chart so what kind of chart you want in this video we are going to use a uh, pie chart so let me create chart one and workbook dot add chart we need to add the chart or workbook and the type is a uh, pie the type is pie okay now we are going to add a data series to a chart uh, we are going to use add series method and also uh, we need to configure the first series like for example sheet name first row first column uh, last row and also last column so like this let me uh, chart one sorry chart one dot add series So add series and now uh, for the name uh, we are going to give a uh, pi cells data and for the categories <coughs> so sheet one and now we need to give the uh, uh, so this was the sheet name and now we need to give the first row our first column so one uh, this is the uh, column and last row so three and last column zero and for the values sheet one and now we need to give one one uh, so the, uh, the so these are the first row and first column and for the last row three and uh, also we need to give one so one one uh, three one first row first column first row first column last one last column okay so this is for the values now after this uh, I'm going to add also a title a title to my chart so chart one dot title and for the title <coughs> you can give it as a dictionary and I'm going to give it uh, uh, whatever you want for example let me uh, give the name for example uh, fruit fruits data chart like this okay uh, now we need to set an excel chart style uh, and uh, we are going to use the white color for the outline uh, so let me write chart one dot also we are going to use the shadow so set style <coughs> 10 okay now after this we are going to insert the chart into the worksheet so with an offset uh, for example the uh, top left corner of a chart is anchored to cell uh, c2 now worksheet dot insert chart c2 chart one and x x underscore of set so it uh, is uh, for example uh, 25 and y underscore offset this is 10 and the finally and the last code is we need to close uh, our excel file so workbook 
dot clues so this is the code and uh, I will add a source code to the video description don't worry in my blog you can check my blog and now let me just run this and let me run it so I have a problem in here so before this if you see let me I have forgot to show you uh, but after that I will see the problem uh, you can see that uh, for right now uh, I have uh, it's created a chart pipe let me check this that I have the uh, chart in here or not so yeah you can see I have a chart uh, force and code so unknown worksheet reference sheet one and range sheet one so let me just I think uh, where is the yeah this is it should be sheet one okay so let me just remove this again uh, sorry uh, remove this chart pie uh, do rig factor okay now I don't have the that file now let me just run it again okay now you can see we don't have any problem but you can see we have chart pi and if I open this show an explorer and let me chart pi run this and now you can see that this is the data and these are this is the uh, that we have created fruits data chart so thank you guys, I will add a source code to the video description. If you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, please subscribe to my channel.